Hello guys, welcome to Tech Recovery IT Solutions and in today's video I'm going to show you how to uh, clean up your computer from unwanted files. You might don't know but uh, there are a lot of files uh, in the computers which are not necessary and Windows has to create it with the time. Uh, so if we delete them, uh, they're not gonna harm us. So first of all, uh, you have to click Control S or you can do it this way as well start on uh, click on start and type in cleanup it's gonna come up with this cleanup click ok it's gonna ask you which drive you want to clean up so it's c because uh, my c has the operating system so it's up to you just uh, uh, confirm which uh, partition has the operating system and uh, open that one so i've opened this one now there are a lot of options and you have to uh, select which uh, once you want to delete so um, download program files uh, which is empty for me temporary internet files you can delete those thumbnails you can delete those and which are which are not needed right so okay clean up and clean up click ok and it's gonna clean up now and it's gonna delete the uh, unwanted uh, files from my computer and this is only one step uh, we'll go uh, step by step uh, and i'll show you how to do uh, for do it further now you can also delete all these files as well um, you can del delete windows update uh, update cleanup because these files uh, are required when you download the update uh, updates for your uh, windows and this file can only, uh, is only be used by installing the updates for the installation of the updates so after that there is no need of it and it's taking a lot of space 8 gb of my computer space so if i delete it it's not gonna harm me and my computer and it's gonna um, uh, give me some space so you can delete those go for ok delete and yeah it will take some time because the files are big uh, but uh, it will help so just wait for it and when it's done i'll show you the next step so this cleanup is done now we'll go for the next step uh, click on uh, search bar or um, you have to click on start another way is uh, click on uh, windows key plus s and type in storage and it will come up with storage setting open that and in storage setting you will get all these options uh, these are the categories of your personal data so if you want to delete your personal data it's an easy way to understand which is important and which is not important for you because it gives you the options in categories while in front end uh, your data is all your data is in you know one shape pictures and applications and downloads are mixed but in here you can choose a specific uh, category and you can work on it but our most important part is temporary files so in my case it's 5 gb almost which is like you know really uh, good amount of storage if your hard drive is not that uh, big so click on uh, temporary files wait for it a bit because it's reading the data so these are file your personal download folder select this if you'd like to delete everything does it okay so in download folder if you think that in your download folder folder there is something important so my suggestion is to go and um, uh, separate that files and then delete everything because in downloads normally uh, we, we have the applications uh, set up we want to install we download it and it stays there for a really long time right and if you think there is nothing important for you then click on download so i'll keep it i'll uh, go through because i have some files i'll um, separate it and then i'll delete it but the rest this is a step of the video you can follow it and like you know by by default these are selected and the selected files if you delete uh, it's not gonna harm you so I'm gonna delete those which are already selected so it's done already and uh, okay now you can also um, turn on this feature which will uh, automatically delete your temporary or unwanted file from your computer uh, with the time so you can turn this on as well and uh, yeah let's go for the next step 
so guys the next step uh, we are going to discuss uh, which is really important and you have to um, put some concentration on it uh, you have to uh, click on start and type uh, control panel and in control panel uh, you have to uh, go for programs and features and programs and features uh, these are the programs which your computer has installed and uh, sometimes when you are installing one application they will ask you if you allow this application to install the required application when it required and we click yes without reading the terms and conditions right so it's gonna install a lot of unwanted stuff even some antiviruses which causes a lot of issues so the best practice is to follow this step really um, like with complete concentration uh, so again you have to click on start and type in control panel and in control panel click on programs and features and in programs and features these are the programs your computer has so go through it and if you think there is nothing uh, which is like unwanted leave it but if you think but there must be that's for sure but if you think there is there are like you know a lot of uh, applications which you don't want then an easy way to uh, delete it right click on it and uninstall the changes so there are like you know um, a lot of um, applications which runs in the background and which is not good for a com uh, of your computer so uh, a best way is to go through it and delete anything you don't want and that will help a lot uh, i don't have that much unwanted applications because uh, my uh, in my case i'm doing uh, an installation of these applications normally so that's why they're not that much in there but you can uninstall a lot of them because if you don't know about this feature then 100 percent your computer will have a lot of unwanted stuff so go through this one and un delete all unwanted files and 100 percent you will feel uh, much relief on your computer and you will feel it you know like more speedy and fast uh, thank you very much for watching this video if you like it and it helps please uh, subscribe to my channel thank you very much bye